Today we got a 2021 Roush, which is a Ford Mustang. Uh, Ford Mustang 2021. We are going to install the amplifier using the high-low converter. And uh, this one has got an amplifier. The amplifier is at the... Uh, <coughs> You, if you look on the driver kick, you'll see an amplifier right there. Now trying to run a four gauge wire to this and I'm going to have to pop all this out. So I can run the wire straight through that to the battery over there. Now here's a trick to this thing, how to run this power wire. You see that hole right there on the bottom? Let me see if I can see that. See that hole right there? I kind of use the, uh, you can use something. Uh, this actually, this was the, uh, uh, <clears throat> oh, what you call that? Uh, electric tape feeder. I cut it about uh, three feet. And then I kind of till it up a little bit from the from the back or from the uh, driver side. All right, what I do, I cut about three inches, and then I cut half this, and then I'm gonna stick in this hole right here, and then tape them up and spray some WD-40. So now I got all the wire coming out. I'm gonna just pull it in some more, keep pulling it, and make sure I got enough wire to go to the battery right there, because I had to go that that I had to put a uh, <clears throat> a fuse holder right there let's just get a little bit extra and then now I'm gonna run this wire going through this piece and then run it all the way out there I usually take this boot out a little bit right there and then uh, shave it a little bit about that much hole so you can push it through easier okay Running through here is too much work. I'm not going to do that. That's too much work. Plus, what I'm seeing right there, the uh, uh, windshield wiper uh, motor and everything is right there. That's too much of a risk or fire hazard. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to pull it back out here. I'm going to run through here. And I'm going to put a wire loom through it and call it a day. Now I'm going to start running my power wire by removing this panel right there. Keep pushing up front book and pull that out and then also there's a clip right there you're gonna have to take it out you need a, a needle nose and push that out did i say needle nose no i meant this gotta use two hand now i want to explain this part right there now you want to push uh let's say this is in there you want to push this in right here Where's my camera? This push that in and then twist it up right here this side and then push the other opposite side and then you pull this plate out. It's just basically a clip, but don't break that. Here's a trick to this. You want to run the power wire right there, and then you want to push this uh, clip right there out a little bit, and then you want to shove it down here and then pull it out this way. So you don't have to take the whole piece off. Now I ran the power wire going through there, coming down here, down here, and right there. You don't have to take the whole seat off. If you do, you can, but you don't want to. That's just a waste of time. What I'm going to do, I'm going to pull right there. I'm going to sand it right here. Make sure you're not hitting the, uh, the wire. That's kind of hard to do right there. With one hand, I'm going to do what I just done. What I did, I removed this piece out and then sand it. If you don't have a sander, just use a flat head and uh, get rid of this paint and then screw the soft type of screw to it. Right there. And then now put the wire back down here. Now over here, the red wire is I consider as positive and then red black is negative 
I'm gonna use SNI35. I'm gonna hook it up the red wire to the uh, white and gray together. And then uh, red and black, I'm gonna hook it up to white, black, gray, black together. And then I'm gonna have to run the RCA jack from here to the input of this amp right here. You probably noticed that I'm, I have kickers, kiss lock two, and I have uh, uh, SNI35 made by pack you don't want that you know i mean the reason i take i use this because i didn't ran the uh remote wire up front and then i couldn't figure out anywhere else i mean there's an amplifier doesn't i couldn't figure out the color so i didn't have enough time to check uh the remote wire at the amplifier i mean even though there should be one but i didn't have that time so i use case lock 2 which got a built-in remote wire you got the uh, red right here to the white, gray, and then you got red, black to the white, black, gray, black. And then you're gonna have to hook up the blue to the remote and black to the ground. And then that's, that's it. I'm gonna take that off. After I video this, I'm gonna take that off and uh, fix the, uh, make sure it look neat. And also back over the, uh, over here, uh you probably can see this too there's two of this right there you got you don't want to hook up to the green white and purple green it's got too much power to the uh high low converter the line out converter you would want to use the left rear which is the uh this one right here white green to the positive and then uh brown yellow to the negative that's to the uh line out converter if you don't do that, it will not sound right. I, I tried it right here to the sub. It does not sound right. So I took it off and redo. 